Hi everyone, Jake here. Um, this is a bit more of a serious video because um, I feel like I need to better myself. I feel like I'm an adult now and I need to like try and get better at life. But I also want to do something for me. Like uh, I've struggled with my weight my entire life. I've always been kind of skinny fat, I think I like to call it. It's like an, you're a bit too skinny to be chubby, but you're not that fat to be like fat. Do you know what I mean? So I'm like kind of in the middle. But recently I have put on a little bit more weight than I've liked. So I've kind of moved from that skinny fat phase to the more of the overweight, bigger kind of me. And I'm not feeling good in my body. Like in my head, not to sound like a bit of a douchebag though, but like I think I've got quite a good looking face, but like I will not go out on a date and I will not chat people up just because like my my face is nice, but my everything else is kind of like not that good. So I kind of like just don't even try. I don't even go there when I'm trying to speak to people or talk to people or try and get someone's attention. So um, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to better myself. So I've been thinking about working out. Um, I've been doing a lot of research. I bought one pound pair of trainers from Primark. They were one pound in their workout and they're like rubber. And I've got quite heavy feet, so like, it's really good. Um, but yeah, I've been doing a lot of research. Um, you need to change your diet. I need to change that up. Like today, like, ah, oh, it took my entire being not to go out and get chips. Like, Saturday, today's Saturday, and Saturday is my chip day. Saturday has been my chip day for 22 years of my life. Like, I go out and have chips with my family and I sit down. But today I was all like... Jake, you're not having chips. You're gonna have some rice and some carrots and some sweet corn. So I had some rice, carrots and sweet corn. Um, and oh yeah, yeah, it took me mental energy because I love chips so much. Oh, but um, yeah, I'm kind of proud that I didn't have chips today. I know that's like such a small thing, but like, kind of proud of it as well. Like, I think it's just I feel like this is like a load of small things that you got to try and do to better yourself, and then it can gradually snowball into something better. Um. But yeah, you need to start off with, you need to combine a healthy diet with some healthy exercise. And them two, it seems really easy when you think about it, but like, it seems really hard when you're trying to do it. Um, yeah, so I need to eat healthy. I'm trying to work on that right now. Um, try not to snack when I'm at work. Try and get better lunches in. Try and incorporate a bit more fruit and, fruit and vegetable into my diet. Um, I mean, I'm a vegetarian, I'm the worst vegetarian in the world, I'll give you that. Um, but yeah, I also need to exercise more. Now, my, my idea of exercise for the past couple of years was when I was in university, I could, I would take a 45 minute walk to university and from university, and that would be all hills. So I racked up about 18 to 20,000 um, steps a day just by walking to and from university, and it was quite an intense walk intense walk because I'd speed walk with my stuff up and down hills and that's what I do and I was kind of losing weight I was kind of happy in my body but now I'm not in university anymore it's really hard for me to do that intensive style of walking um, so I'm going to move away and try and do something better so what I bought was uh, let me try and find it What I bought was a jumping rope because I do really love jumping rope. I actually just like jumping itself. <laughs> I think it's so, it's such a nice, joyful experience to do. Sorry, I was just checking out if these pants were clean or not. Like, do you mean you just have stuff on the floor? Excuse that, that was really weird. Um, but yeah, I bought jumping rope to try and do a bit more cardio because I get a bit embarrassed when I'm going out jogging because I'm all like, I don't really want people to see me. Um, and I downloaded a couple apps to do like 30 day challenges, which are kind of like a good way to do it. Because um, if you can set yourself a goal and try and work for it each day, then it seems a bit more better than trying to work for like a six month goal. Because then you're like seeing, yeah, I accomplished something today. Woo. Um, but I think that's just how I work. Uh, I have considered going to the gym, but like I really don't want to go in the gym on my own. I have really bad gym anxiety. I, re I wasn't really not sure where to go. Like... Um, all my friends lift and not really sure what to do because <laughs> they're all in Aberystwyth and down south and up down all over the place. Um, but it's just kind of one of them things. But yeah, like 
I've never had muscle, like, ever. I've just been really skinny with, like, a bit of fat. I mean, like, see, at the moment I look kind of skinny, but, like, if I was to stand up and, like, show you this, like, I do have a lot of um, weight distribu distributed around my stomach, and I do have stretch marks to show that. And here, sorry about the unshaven mess of things. I really don't like to shave. Um, but yeah, it's kind of affecting me now because I'm kind of like, I need to be healthy. Um, I don't have the metabolism that I used to now that I'm 22. Now that I'm 22. Um, and I think it's affecting me socially and in a romantic way. Not that they, like, big people, the bigger people can't get in relationships and stuff like that, but like, I think I need to do it more for myself because then I'll feel a bit more comfortable in the way I am. And I know I should body positive and feel more comfortable in the skin I am. But at the moment, I did weigh myself. I was like, I weighed myself a couple weeks ago, which was really bad. And I think I've only gained weight since then. But I was 204 pounds back then. And that was overweight for my height category. I'm six foot. Um, and I just kind of want to feel a bit more confident in myself. So I'm starting off with this. 30 day thing where I start off really low like I looked at the stuff that it wanted me to do it was like 15 jumping jacks and then 12 crawls and I was like oh yeah that sounds quite easy but I'm guessing it's just time to build you in so you gradually 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 get it better and um hopefully I'll get a bit better but other than that yeah weight is a big thing I think weight weight some people, it doesn't really concern them. I have like a lot of skinny friends who can just eat whatever they fucking want and drink, 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 and nothing will happen. But um, for some people, it's like, it doesn't really work that way. So it kind of waits a bit more. And then sometimes I just don't have any self-control and I lose self-control. And um, I think I need to work a bit more on that, which I think I'm going to get there gradually. Um, stop using food to excuse everything. <laughs> Plus I need to expand my palate. Like My palate currently is, sorry. My palate currently is like bland foods with tomato sauce put on to the top of it, <laughs> which is uh, not that good. But I love it. I ain't, I'm enjoying it. <laughs> um, but yeah, weight weight loss. I think I'll get there. Hopefully, I want to just just try and stick to something. I'm not really good at sticking to things. Um, but hopefully, I can stick to this, and maybe at the end of it, I will be happy but yeah i'll do this 30 days and i'll give you updates in between but i'm gonna go off and do my first time day one now um and try and be a bit better um i want to give it like a couple weeks or a bit just so i can incorporate the jump rope um or go for a jog or more, a bit more intensive walking but yeah thank you all for watching this five <laughs> this very long segment and i'll give you updates throughout the month Thank you very much.